Hello, my name is Father Joe Marcou. I'm the pastor of St. Catherine of Siena Parish in Ithaca, New York. Uh, prior to being ordained in 2001, I was a chef uh, in New York City and in the Finger Lakes region. In my family, in my tradition, when Thanksgiving or Easter or Christmas came around, um, it wasn't just about church, uh, although it was a lot about church, but uh, it, it was a lot about food and church. And everything that we did kind of revolved around the kitchen and right across the street to the church. So one of the things that we always had for, for the holidays was artichokes. So I was gonna do an artichoke um, appetizer for you. Um, we're gonna do artichokes French, which can seem a little daunting to a lot of people, but it's not really, don't get scared. I'm gonna talk you through it and it's gonna be really easy and people are gonna love your food and you're gonna be like a hero for Christmas, okay? The very first important thing is to have artichokes. Drain them and cut them in half. You need to um, have a, uh, an egg wash for the artichoke French. So the next ingredient that you need are some eggs. I have three eggs in this bowl. Into the uh, egg wash, you put a little bit of water and a little bit of Parmesan cheese, okay? And a little bit of cream. You can put a little bit of parsley in there too. it would be very nice, okay? Other ingredients that you're going to need for this, some all-purpose flour, some lemon juice, a little chicken stock, the heavy cream, butter, a little parsley, and red pepper for garnish. Really simple. For the artichokes as we cook them, you're going to dredge them in the flour, then in the egg wash. And the real key to artichokes French is right here. You take a little bit of the egg wash on your fingers, put it in the oil, okay? which is, I, I have probably about probably two and a half cups of oil in here in this pan and see how it fired right up there. That means it's ready to go. These will cook very quickly. Um, so watch. There's a beautiful. I'm going to take those ones right out. Put them right on the platter. Okay, the only thing we have left to do is uh, prepare this sauce. We're going to make a sherry reduction sauce with, and finish it with some butter. Uh, so it is gonna be a nice creamy sauce. So you gotta get your pan really nice and hot. We're gonna take a little bit of sherry, cooking sherry, and we're gonna fire the sherry. What we're gonna do is you get your pan really hot, pull it off of the stove, pour in the sherry. I put about a cup in there. And then you're gonna tilt it this way so it can get the fire. Come on. There we go. And it's gonna fire and you're gonna just burn off the alcohol. We're gonna add a little bit of, oops, little bit of uh, chicken broth and a little bit of cream. I have the juice of one lemon. I'm gonna pour that in. As soon as the, the sauce begins to boil here, you can see it's boiling. We're gonna finish the sauce with some raw butter. That's butter at room temperature. And you just keep, as you put it in, you just keep stirring and it turns into this really thick, creamy, wonderful, beautiful sauce. Now don't worry, this looks like a lot of butter. It isn't. Um, my father was French Canadian and we use butter for everything. So don't worry, I'm still alive. You're gonna be fine. To finish our sauce, we're just gonna put in a little bit of chopped parsley. We chopped early earlier and then pour it right over our artichokes french. If you're going to serve this at your Christmas meal, just add a little bit of diced red pepper and Merry Christmas, green and red.